mostly in French language and French music, but they are here. It's a great networking opportunity for these artists to really interact with other, other artists with a similar musical genre, but they're also able to network with record industry executives and booking agents that can get them other great gigs such as Festival International. Josh Many with their story starting off our team coverage tonight. During peak submission season, I get 60 to 80 different bands uh, a week, I would say, that try to apply to the festival. John Horniak is the senior executive director of the Memphis chapter of the Recording Academy. So we're the organization that does the Grammy Awards. You know, the, the Motion Picture Academy does the Oscars, the Television Academy does the Emmys, the Recording Academy does the annual Grammy Awards. For me, it's just being able to just feel something. Horniak is one of the many music and record executives in town for Festival International, all of them looking for the world's next big music star. We always want to be aware of the happening artists, you know, some we're familiar with because of past recordings or whatever, but we always are paying attention to who we think the most important artists are in the various regions of the country. And this is one of the, the great areas for music in the world. Danchette is a full country blues band from Quebec. This weekend they'll be performing cuts from their new album, Gaspar Cana, which blends life on Gaspar Z Peninsula with Americana music. We talk a lot between the songs. Uh, we uh, share uh, the story of the songs uh, with people, and I think that people write, uh, love to hear that. So. Another Canadian artist, Shaw Wee, will also perform at festival. He meshes his life as a member of the Inu Nation in Quebec with reggae rhythms and vocals. So I try to to tell uh, you know positive messages in my in my songs. So I talk about love. I talk about uh, uh, environment. You know, nature. I talk about uh, God. I talk about uh, what I believe. You know. And before the weekend is over, he or any of the other festival performers could leave festival with a major record deal. In Lafayette, Josh Many, KTC TV3. Hard not to tap your toes with music.